So here's my hood that I picked up for this car. So on the original car that it came off of, uh, the hood blew open on the guy and uh, bent right here and curled these ends up on this. Of course, I plan on sticking to the white theme, but if any of you guys seen the Dodge Challenger where it's got two nostrils down the front where the nose is open, where the stripes would be, there's two hood scoops facing open, facing another way. So I plan on putting them on there. But uh, before I got to do that, I got to straighten this issue out here with this. I paid 50 bucks for that. That's 350 bucks for that right there right now. I wouldn't sell it for less than 350 to you. So got to get my tires aired up on here. Uh, starting at the very back. Uh, getting all that cleaned up, doing the roof and everything, getting everything primered out. Then I'm going to drop the rear end, do the spine replacement, spindle replacement, uh, spindle replacement, and uh, slap some wheels on here and uh, get it looking all right. Try to get some stuff powder coated uh, in between there. Uh, I'm just going to get this floor pan stuff done and built and then... I think I'm just gonna go with a rhino line or a bed line in the whole interior and the roof on it. So stay tuned for that. But check those out, shaved door handles, I've done that. I'm gonna do everything to this car myself. Um, there's no wiring running through it. There's no brake lines, nothing like that. I'm gonna do the wiring, I'm gonna do the brake lines, I'm gonna do everything there is to do it. Uh, build the insides of it, put the dash in it, upgrade the brakes, upgrade everything, put a lift on it, lift it up 13 inches, put some big 26 inch rims on it. I'm gonna do all that to it, but I gotta get the cradle fixed where they notch the cradle. And uh, I've got a couple of fellas, I'm gonna do all that. And uh, I'm gonna do everything else to it personally myself uh, in a short period of time. So uh, I think the next thing I'm going to try to do for a couple hundred bucks is going and getting this trunk sandblasted and, and epoxied. So uh, stay tuned for that.